Hello, Taurus. Welcome to your reading. We're going to do a you versus them and singles read today. I'm looking forward to getting into some energy here. I have like a list of a million things to do, and yet I spent all morning long dealing with the care and giving of my 80 plus year old mother with dementia who gave out all of her beautiful information to scammers this morning. Name, birthday, maiden name, mother's name, mother's maiden name, father's name, <laughs> social security number, banking information. I'm like, she says to me, well, I asked them if they were a fraud and they said no. <laughs> and I don't know why I'm telling you this, except for maybe you need to hear this. Maybe you have your own parent going through this, or maybe you need to hear that just because someone tells you something doesn't mean that it's true. Right? I'm like, haven't I told you? When anyone calls you, if they say that they're from this organization, say, Okay, well, I'm going to hang up now, and I'm going to call the direct number. <laughs> I mean, it's a simple, simple sentence. <sighs> Luckily, the last time she was defrauded, I set everything up to being frozen. So, and her bank has known her, right? She's in a small little bank, small community. They've known her for 40 years, and so... They just played games with these people when they called and said, oh, don't you realize that you closed all your accounts? Don't you remember doing that? These people. <laughs> all right, if you are returning, thank you so much. I love you. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Okay, at the end of the reading, I will uh, be doing extended. It's a Patreon, which is donation based. You can pay what you can. Some people pay a dollar. Some people pay 15. You pay what you can. You can change it up every month based on what's going on in your life. Um, I will also be doing my sacred circle. If you go to the belightcreate.com and you go to the sacred circle, you will be able to see the sacred circle is now open for registration. That is also donation based. We're going to be working with the golden transmissions. It's shamanic. It's a little woo. It's a little star CD, right? We'll see what's going on. And that will be March 18th. Okay. So let's see what's going on here for you, Taurus. Okay, again, you're crossing the bridge and I know you're crossing the bridge because underlying is the bridge. Like, you know you're crossing the bridge. You know you're moving on from something. You're like, yeah, I'm letting go. Yeah, I'm moving on to a new journey. Yeah, it's what I've been visualizing. But are you trying to control it? Okay. Because you're like, I... I'm holding back my judgment here until I actually get there because I don't really know if this is going to be better or not. So you're refusing to burn bridges <laughs> because you're like, just in case I need to run my ass back, I'm keeping this space here, right? But you have broken yourself free from something and you've got the fire already. You're like, I'm all ready. If I get to that other side and it looks good, I'm going to throw that torch and burn that bridge down and I'm never going back. But just in case, I'm going to control the torch. Okay. Very interesting, Taurus. Now, of course, roles can be reversed. It could be the third party storyline. Whenever you come upon this, time is fluid. What if it resonates for you in a year? That's when it was meant for you. Okay. So what's going on with Taurus? Thank you. Thank you. The energy that Taurus is dealing with, which could be person, place, or thing. Okay. Underlying eight of pentacles. Okay. Again, you're very hard at work. I feel like in creating this new pentacle. Okay. This new whatever it is that you're going towards. Okay. What's going on with you here, Taurus? 
Knight of Cups, judgment. Again, judgment is what I saw earlier. And the Four of Cups, right? Like, yeah, I'm moving forward. I feel good. Offers are coming, right? This is for my best, my best good. But just in case, I'm just going to sit on these three cups. Just in case this new cup coming in. Just in case. I, I just got to make sure. Right, Barbara? I just got to make sure. Okay. Knight of Cups. Yeah, temperance. You're, you're, you're like, well, I got to keep this number just in case I got to call it. Right? Like, I, I'm, you know, being very patient with this move. I know that I'm doing this. It's for my best judgment. Death. Here's the thing. What Spirit's saying to me is that they're like, do you realize that it's very rare that someone has that near-death experience where they die and they come back? That doesn't happen very often. Okay? So this seems like it's a very hard, fast line. And so very few of you even are going to have the opportunity available to go back. But yet your mind is like, yeah, mm, that, that's me. Okay? Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. I'm going ahead to the Eight of Pentacles, but I, I'm still looking back at that Seven. Right? I'm still making sure that there's something back there to go back to. Page of Cups. But I'm still going to take this chance towards this brand new beginning, right? Because where you've been has been just stuck. And you've tried networking. You've tried working on yourself. And you just feel like there's nothing else I can do but move forward. But yet you're still keeping it open. Okay. The energy that you are dealing with closed off. Five of Pentacles crossed by the devil. Okay. Good night, moon. This is somebody here that is toxic. And they know it. And you know it. And they are unemotional. They are emotionally unavailable. There may be some very hot running passions, but they kind of keep you, oh, you're over here in this compartment and everything else is over here in this compartment. And if this is about work, right? Like they just want you to come and do and, and be and get over it, right? But I do feel for most of you, this is about love, right? This is a love reading. <laughs> Five of Pentacles here. Yeah, they end in reverse. Despite the fact that there's a huge separation here because of this toxicity, their opinion is you're never, you're never going anywhere. Wait. Hold on. Sorry about that. My name is Oliver. And I have issues. My whole world has changed over the last six months and I'm struggling with it. And I was already a pandemic puppy who had been abused before my mommy found me. And then I didn't see people for three years and then my daddy moved away and I have issues. Do you want to say you're sorry to Taurus? Mm -hmm. Oh, he gave Taurus a little lick. Taurus, you got a little lick. Okay, Oliver, sorry. Good boy. So this person, despite everything, is like, you're not going anywhere. There is, there's just nowhere that you could go. You're just, they just know. You You've said you're going to leave before, or you've acted like you're going to move on before, but you're not going anywhere, okay? Yeah. Two of Cups in reverse. They know that this is toxic. They probably know that this is a karmic connection. All right. Nine of Cups. But they give you just enough to keep you going. 
okay? They also could see a little something in you that's different because you are in that Knight of Cups energy, okay? Four of Swords, but they might think that it's just you resting and recovering, and right? That's why you've pulled a little bit of your emotions away, the hangman. Okay, you've been waiting for this person to give a ring to you, to put a ring on it, Spirit's saying. They have no intention of it. You may even have a child with this person and they still are not emotionally giving to you. Maybe a tiny smidge here and there, but um, they're not gonna put a ring on it, okay? Five of Swords in reverse. Uh, they don't think that it's their problem. And they don't see it as being a problem. Because we've got the Six of Swords and then the Seven of Swords. Okay, this is somebody who's like, listen. Right? They could be somebody that left another situation for you. Or they feel like they've done all the work they have to do to get here. And there are parts of them and parts of their life that is none of your business. Okay. So. Let's see what's going on here with our singles in this. Okay. Oof. Three of Wands in reverse crossed by the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, you don't expect that what you're creating is going to be that much better, but you're still creating it. Knight of Pentacles. You have been going towards a new direction in a while. Okay. Um, slowly but surely growing, becoming more spiritually intuitive. Okay. Six of swords and judgment. There's a part of you that's like, I know that if I just keep moving forward, there are blessings. The sky will clear. The sun will come out. It's going to be healthier for me. Right. When I get to the other side of this bridge, like I know where I'm going. Right. Yep. You know, there's an ace of cups which could just be loving yourself at the other side of this ending. But what else is there? The moon? You just don't know. Okay. And again, it could be just about yourself. Like, right? We have this moon uh, coming up here in March, which is this moon of new self is what I'm being told by spirit. And so I do feel like this is a very important stride forward for yourself. And it's a breaking away from past pains. Let's get some advice moving forward here for Taurus. Yeah. Okay. You are going to have some sort of friend that's looking out for you and helping you and supporting you six of wands with the queen of swords it could be somebody that's just your badass friend no love interest or none that you know of yet that uh is just there for you helping you out supporting you connecting with you right could have felt like this was off limits for a while Again, because you've been dealing with this situation that you just couldn't get out of. But you have options opening up. And a lot of this is just within you of who you are and where you're going and what you want. Big completion cycle. Okay. And it feels good. It feels good to be creating for you. What you don't understand here, okay, Seven of Cups and the Seven of Pentacles, is that you are the one that's been manifesting all of this coming up from under the surface, okay, right, the Emperor, to make the move that's right for you. Seven of Swords, okay. 
the Ace of Swords and Justice. One, 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 you manifested this path forward. It's changing your mindset. Um, it's making you realize that you were not crazy. What you felt intuitively was that you needed to move forward with your life to find happiness. Okay, and this balances you like no tomorrow. Okay, let's get some advice here from Spirit. Yeah, again, you're following the alchemy of wishes here. Okay, three of cups. And... It's like everything that you wished for from this past energy that you didn't get, you're putting into yourself is what they're showing me, right? Yeah, Knight of Cups, that's all about you. All about you, babe, right? And that's how you attract your divine union within yourself, which attracts a divine union outside of yourself. Okay, because what you've been dealing with has been as stuck as you and you've been mirroring that and you can't, <coughs> Spirit says someone needs to hear this, you can't get blood from a stone and if you're another stone then what would you do with it anyway, right? Four of Cups. Spirit says, yeah, I know you're afraid of this next stage, okay, Emperor, the Chariot, okay, yeah, another seven, so we've got seven, 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 <laughs> I know there was, I think there was another seven, <laughs> There's a lot, no, there's a lot of sevens here, but there's also that eight of pentacles that you are moving towards. So you're getting ready to move forward, but it's like you got to release the control and allow yourself to let go. Okay. Yeah, you are deserving of this. And yes, underlying, you are feeling some loss. But again, right, this is a dream you've had for a long time to free yourself from whatever's been holding you back. And you're really ready for this. Don't worry about throwing that fire on the bridge and never turning back. Because sometimes that is the healthiest thing to do. All right. So I hope this helps you. I hope you guys have a beautiful rest of the week. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. I am going to move over to Patreon now to the donation program and see how they are feeling about you. Okay, if this resonated, give me a thumbs up for sure so that I know that I am picking up on your energy. Leave me some feedback if you wanna share your story with myself or someone else, okay? Much love guys, bye.